A New York man's been arrested for impersonating his dead mother for six years in order to steal nearly $200,000. Thomas Parkin wore a wig, thick makeup, and his mum's old dresses to collect benefit checks, visit banks, and even appear in court. CNN's Joe Torres explains. This guy's not stupid. This guy's very smart. And, you know, I, I, I think, you know, his, his schemes were absolutely brilliant. Sure. That assessment from the, the Brooklyn District services. Attorney about Thomas Parkin. Investigators say for six years, the 49-year-old ran an elaborate scheme that involved Parkin dressing as and impersonating his mother, Irene Prusik, who died in 2003. He wore a scarf around his neck so that um, it would prevent us from seeing the Adam's apple. He had large sunglasses even inside the house when we went to see him. And he had a, um, an oxygen mask on his face as well. This surveillance video taken two months ago shows Parkin dressed as his mom inside the Coney Island DMV office. To his left, say investigators, is Milton Romolo, Parkin's business partner who acted as Mrs. Prusik's nephew. The DA says Parkin also doctored his mother's death certificate and falsified her social security number and date of birth, thereby enabling the suspects to receive $52,000 in social security benefits. Furthermore, say investigators, the pair fraudulently received $65,000 in city rental assistance for this Park Slope townhouse, a home originally owned by Mrs. Prusik, then deeded to her son, then sold at a foreclosure auction. For creativity, this comes out number one.